Alright guys, so Luke is three weeks out from his next powerlifting competition. To get straight into it, Luke, just give us an overview of what program you're following. So I follow Jim Wandler's 531 program and I'm liking it. I only started it uh, just after Christmas. This is my first time uh, having a go at it and I really like the way it's all set out. I feel like I've been getting stronger in it. Uh, for my previous competition, I did the cube method. I did gain some strength uh, there, but I think that might be down to just the fact that I was new to powerlifting and therefore would get strength gains on whatever program I had because, you know, newbie gains yeah. and everything like that. Uh, but this 531 program, I'm really enjoying and hopefully we'll see in the next competition in three weeks whether or not I actually am stronger. Yeah, we'll be able to see the results of it, how well it works. Exactly, yeah. Awesome. So, um, obviously you do the big lifts, uh, deadlifting, benching and squatting. Yeah. But, um, what about the accessory lifts to uh, help you out with that? All right, so I also do another day, like the program suggests, I do a whole day on overhead press as well, which follows the same kind of skeleton outline. Uh, and then for the main lifts, I like to squat again on deadlift day uh, for reps just to get the movement, just to keep the movement going really. Uh, I then bench also on um, squat day as well, so I'm benching and squatting twice a week, deadlift once, but I do heavy um, pen lay rows or bent over rows uh, which helps. And then I do basically the uh, the usual, so I'll do close grip, sometimes I'll do um, uh, incline benching as well, I'll do some high bar and some front squats, and uh, yeah, and for deadlifts as well I'll do like deficit or stiff leg pulls really, for the main ones, and then I'll just kind of see how I feel and do little bits that I feel weak at really. Alright, so just to help with uh, extra little bits of each lift, really? Yep, pretty much. Awesome. So what were your uh, previous uh, PBs that you got at your uh, last powerlifting competition? Right. So I squatted 210 kilograms, I benched 130 kilograms, and I deadlift 242.5 yep. kilograms. So, uh, so quite a bit. It was a... It was, it was all right. So that right. that gave me a 582.5 title. Nice. Uh, total. So you're uh, hoping to get be in the 600 uh, total pretty soon, then? I'm yeah, I'm hoping to. We'll have to see. At the moment, I'm going through my openers and uh, everything like for the next competition to see how I, you know, how I feel. Right. Really? So what is the next powerlifting uh, competition? Uh, it's the British University Championships. So it's a big one. Pretty yeah, big it is one. a big one. So I'm not saying I'm a, I'm great at powerlifting or anything like that, but I'm going to give it a go. And I'm basically just going there to try and beat myself, really, for my last competition. Yeah. That's really it. I mean, I would like to, to be in at least, at least the top ten. Uh, that's like a, an, a secondary goal, yeah. but as long as I beat myself, I'm happy. There's going to be some strong people there, so. Yeah. Right, so what category are you uh, competing at then? Uh, so I compete in the 105 uh, kilogram weight class. 105? Yep. Right, so the last one was also at that. Uh... Yes, yeah, so yeah, I'm the same one. I'm a little bit heavier now. Uh, I was, I'm now at the top end of that weight category, whereas my previous one I was... 102 when I competed. Yeah, right. Well, thanks very much for that. So, good insight on uh, how you power lift. So, yeah, like us, uh, share, subscribe, and enjoy. See ya.